بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إذا جاء نصر الله والفتح أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم الله سبحانه وتعالى إن دود إمام المهدي with irrefutable proof called the seal or stamped of the wilayah. Imam al-Mahdi not only inherited the moral and intellectual qualities of the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, he also inherited from him a physical and corporal imprint with a seal affixed between his noble shoulder blades. This stamp of the wilaya of Imam al-Mahdi presents a different aspect. It does not have the circular and closed shape of the seal of prophecy. It is rather open, unfolded in a line position, and takes the form of a slightly inclined horizontal line, giving it the shape of an arrow. The stamp or seal of Imam al-Mahdi is composed of four points, each corresponding to a letter, which are Mim, Ha, Mim, Dal. These letters are the components of the name Muhammad. This seal also has three other explanations in the Batin or hidden domain. Firstly, the four letters constituting the stamp referring to the name Muhammad refers to the name of Imam al-Mahdi. Secondly, these four letters also hide the reality of the four letters which correspond to the hundredth name of Allah, also called Ismullah al-Azam. Thirdly, these four points also represent lines of communication. Let us explain. The haqiqah, the true reality, behind these inscriptions engraved on the body of the Mahdi, is of paramount importance. In fact, all the information that Imam al-Mahdi receives in coming from the word ghaib, or invisible world, passes through this channel of communication. The wahyu that guides Imam al-Mahdi transits to this buffer that is between his right shoulder and the left one. The first point of the seal representing the mim serves as a channel of communication exclusively reserved for the exchanges between Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the Mahdi. The second point, represented by the ha, is a channel used by Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, when he is to speak privately with Imam al-Mahdi. The third point, Determined by Mim is the line of communication dedicated to Mawlai Sheikh Ahmad al-Tijani Sharif, who is not only the spiritual father of the Mahdi, but also the Qatmiyyah and Katmiyyah of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa He uses this channel for his private conversation with Imam al-Mahdi. The last point, which is represented by the Dal, is a common line of communication between Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, Mawlai Shaykh Ahmad Tijan Sharif, and the Mahdi. It is from there that Imam al-Mahdi receives the directives to guide all of humanity. The information that generally passes through this channel is intended for the whole world. It is very wide because the information related to its mission from Ghaib and the wahi he receives go through this link. Let's pay attention a little more. Another very important reality is hidden behind this series of letters, which constitutes the stamp which is located between the right and left shoulder of Imam al-Mahdi. As we said before, the hundredth name of God or the Ismullah al-Azam is inscribed on the hidden side inside the seal. But also, what is incredible is that from each point of the buffer, a light beam emerges. This radiation is continuous in a low light environment. Even non-experts on the subject can distinguish this light from the back of Imam al-Mahdi and more precisely between his two shoulder blades. Thanks to the power he holds, Imam Mahdi can contain and camouflage them. But every night from Thursday to Friday, the night when Hadratul Ilahiyah, the assembly of saints, takes place, the lights intensify and the four points of this time increase in brightness. At this moment, 
The people with him can clearly distinguish the light beams released by each of these four points. All these signs which are integrated in the features of Imam al-Mahdi were deliberately put by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to protect and prepare him for his mission. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuhu.